Kathy and I had uh, planned for a different kind of video for this video, uh, but it didn't quite work out. So we're bringing you this one instead. This is a video clip that I took uh, back in 2023, uh, July. I'm going to, I'm headed to uh, La Hacienda to meet with a friend of mine for lunch. And I give you some clips of, of La Hacienda at the end of the video. But along the way, I talk about uh, the FDR X3000 Sony video recorder that I have. And I also talk about um, Kathy and I, our approach to uh, uh, videoing. Uh, I think it might be helpful to some people. Uh, then toward the end of the video, I get a notice that my neighbor has, has died. And I give her a tribute at the end of this video. So come along. Uh, hopefully the things that we talk about in the video will be things that will be useful to you. If you like the video, give us, you know, do all those standard YouTube things. Uh, you know, give us a thumbs up if you like the video. Uh, subscribe to our channel. Leave us a comment uh, and share the video with somebody that you think might get something out of the video as well. And as always, Kathy and I uh, pray that you just have a very, very blessed day. Hello, people. Uh, still working with my new Sony uh, FDRX 3000. Like I said, I, I like it. it. It is, you know, it's the right size. Uh, I took it yesterday. I had a doctor's appointment in Tifton, and I was going to ride around Tifton and, and use it uh, along with my GoPro 10 to video some of the areas of Tifton up and down Main Street. Uh, but when I got there, uh, the battery was dead. And uh, I don't know why. But anyway, I charged it up overnight. Uh, had a full charge. Uh, so I'm, I'm, I'm recording this. I'm still uh, uh, trying to... Uh, there, there's no... no uh, display of what's being recorded you know and I know on the GoPro you only get a couple of minutes maybe uh, maybe a minute at the beginning where it displays what what the camera's seeing and, and the uh, view screen on the back but at least you get some idea of, 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 and you can leave it there and you'll have a pretty good idea of what's going to be recorded which is important to me because I'm riding in an automobile doing most of my recording and if I'm picking up most of the dash you're not seeing what's out the windshield so i am got to kind of guess at uh, the angle to put the, this FDR uh, X3000 and uh, I had it set on wide angle, and I've changed that now to narrow. I think it's narrow, maybe medium. I can't remember. Uh, but I'll check it when I get back and see how this video turns out. Uh, I, I hope it's going to be fine. I, uh, but getting back to the camera itself, I like the camera. It is not intrusive. It doesn't block my view very much. It's real steady, it's not heavy, uh, it's not bouncing up and down, uh, so, uh, yeah, I like it, it's, it's, uh, but new, it was almost $1,200, uh, even used, I bought this one used from Amazon, and, or it was on Amazon, person advertising. 
and it was uh, almost six hundred dollars. So it's it's still, and all I got was that was with a with a, I got a, a charger. Uh, they sent me a new battery for it. I think that's right. Or it came with a new battery installed. And no, it wasn't installed. It, it, there was a it was loose in the package. And um, and a uh, USB uh, C cord. You know the the small in it USB cord. So yeah. But I think it's gonna work. So I'm gonna let it, let it record a little bit longer. Well, I'm actually headed to Laha today. Uh, meeting with my uh, minister friend. Last week we met at 16 East. I, I'm thinking about making a, a video of that. Uh, coming up on a period when Kathy's not going to be able to travel for about two weeks. Uh, hopefully after that we'll be able to travel a little bit more, more often. Uh, hoping for... Uh, May not work out that way, but I'm hoping for it anyway. And uh, I think the sound on this is going to be good. Uh, it picks up very little uh, inside cabin noise, so that you can hear Kathy and I when we talk a little bit better. And if that's the case. And, and, and the sound's going to be okay. I, I've got to get her. I, that was another thing that I was going to use for uh, uh, yesterday was to see how the sound was going to sound between her and I. Because that's important to us. That uh, part of what we do is our interaction is we're we're uh, going through these little places or even the large places like Tifton is our reaction to the place and. Uh, and, and our thoughts. But you need to understand we're not going to be negative. We, we might tell you that something needs a little work done to it or maybe the folks can clean it up a little bit. But I, I've seen other other uh, people that do this and, and, and that's their, you know, that's their thing. That's, all fine. That's, that's fine if that's what they want to do. I just believe there's enough negativity in the world already You know, maybe there's some things I don't like when I'm going through one of these places. But who am I to say this is bad? You know, I don't know the circumstances. I don't know how things got to be the way they are there. <clears throat> and those folks may be doing the very best that they can do under the circumstances. So under their circumstances. And for me to project, project on them my views and my values... It's just wrong. I'm an outsider. You know, I, I don't have a stake in their, their community. So it's just, it's just not for me to run them down. But if we say something nice, we're certainly going to promote that because there needs to be a little more niceness in the world. You know, uh, we just recently did a video of uh, Ryan Georgia. Hello? Please stand by for an important message from Lee Street Methodist Church. This is Dr. Salvi. It is Thursday, July the 13th at 1150 AM. I have just received the message that Rosa Vining has died. Rosa is our first charter member who has passed. Her funeral will be next Monday, the 17th. The visitation at 1 o'clock p.m. The funeral service will be at 2 o'clock p.m. And everything will be at Hancock Funeral Home on Lee Street. Please keep David and Elise and all the members of the family uh, in your prayers. Rosa was such a wonderful lady, uh, helping not only 
with Magnolia Manor, but our church as well. And may God bless all of the members of the family. Thank you and goodbye. Yeah, Rosa was my neighbor. Uh, lived right across the street from us. Sweet lady. Uh, we actually did a commercial together for uh, Magnolia Manor. And um, <clears throat> she... Uh, then Magnolia Manor decided not to use it. But we did it, and I enjoyed it. That was my first really contact with uh, video and stuff. I didn't know then that it was going to turn in, be the seeds for my YouTube channel. Going to miss her, but, you know, uh, that's life. The Greeks believed that everybody had a thread of life, and uh, when that thread was long enough, uh, it was cut. And that's what's happened to Rosa. Her thread has been cut. Rest in peace, Rosa Vine.